Alright guys, and welcome back to more Sword Art Online Hollow Fragment. I just got done looking at the game's digital manual. and It was actually really well done. It's actually very rem uh, reminiscent to like how the older, like let's say PS1 days, Nintendo 64 days, GameCube days, were like the, co the manual was very vibrant. Even though it was digital, it was, I think it was really well done and explained like so much. But the thing is, I just skimmed through it and it was like a lot of pages to go through but I did look at the like the button control layout and whatnot and it was all there it was all uh, translated too so that was nice but um right now we are back from defeating the uh, the skull hollow whatever you want to call that guy I, I this the skull reaper the skull reaper is what we uh, fought last time and I'm trying so hard to find a way to get out of this menu and I'm scared to push a button because the buttons are completely mi mixed match right now because in Japan they usually have it circle for confirm but in America circle is to cancel here we go can we fight these guys can we engage in battle whoa we can dash nice Ah oh, man, how do we engage battle? I guess it just happens. What the? What is happening? What is happening? <laughs> you know what? Screw this. Here we go. Just smash the circle button. All right. Please stun the enemy. How do I do that? Lightning attack, maybe. No, it better yet. I should probably. Hey, this dude's doing more damage than the tutorial boss, homie. Like, what is this? All right, I just healed myself. R one or pretty much holding R and then pressing circle. Use sword skills together. Okay. Wow, we're still getting bopped. She knows what she's doing, I'm not. <laughs> yeah, he's dead. Like, this dude was tougher than the boss. Alright then. So, we pretty much almost died there for no reason. And every other fight, we're gonna pretty much try to ignore. <laughs> Alright. We... From here on out, we speed running. We speed running, dog. We speed running. Screw this. <laughs> it's not there, it's somewhere down the slope. Oh, we gotta go the other way, homie. Nope, speed running. I'm about to clip through this wall. Check me out. Oh, <laughs> no, nah, man, you can't be doing that. Man, they follow me all the way over here. Nope, you can't follow me down here. They follow me down here, homie. They followed me. I'm about to die, and this is not looking good. They followed me like six years. <laughs> All right, let's let's try fighting the bees here. Yeah, they're a way lower level. All right, let's see. Yeah, look at that. We we took we took that bee out way quicker than that damn spider. And those freaking uh, skull enemies look like they were about to go ham on our lives. I don't think we were supposed to go that way. <laughs> Alright, let's take this other guy out. Let's try to get comfortable with the battle system, okay? Let's let's try to get comfortable. Let's try to beat up on these enemies, you know. Just try to get used. Try to get some experience in our belt, you know what I'm saying? Under our belt. PRT prayer. So that's basically our healing move. Here we go, circle, 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 depth, impact! Ooh, get wrecked, kid! Alright, the bees, the bees were not a match. Alright, uh, I don't know about them orcs, though. Can I use the touch screen for anything? Like, maybe to analyze the enemies? Nope, the touch screen does nothing so far for now. Oh, wait, you touch the uh, map on the screen and it pulls up the bigger map. Alright. You touch your screen again to get rid of the map. 
Looks like these guys leave you alone, but for the most part, we just want to fight the bees. Alright, Death Impact. Ugh. It's pretty much GG, so that's like a combo. You do a number of attacks and then you get a combo chance. Okay. Go through the forest in front of the caves to find the place with the same marking as this emblem. Can I get rid of the text bar? Can I get rid of the text bar? Can I get rid of the text bar? Yes, I can! Guess what? For the photography club action. Yes. <laughs> so R, you hold down R to get rid of the uh, display. So you can take a clean picture like I just did. Communication skill. Your first dungeon at last. Many fights are expected before you reach your goal. Don't forget to work with your partner. How do you save the game? <coughs> Excuse me. Remember, once you're in trouble, you switch. Press the down button to switch with your partner and change enemy aggro. Okay, so you might want to do that when risk is super high, right? Or how does that... When do you want to do that? Yeah, when the risk is high, you probably would want to do that. This way you can get out of danger. Stun the enemy and reset your risk. When risk reset, damage taken will decrease, while burst gauge will charge up faster. It is very useful, so use it as often as you can. So we press down to switch. Okay, okay, alright, okay, I get it. Your partner can turn the tide. When your partner does something right, press up and give him or her your praise. Alright. SP will restore faster with higher morale. The partner will remember the incident and do things that will earn your respect. Okay. So you can basically train the AI by uh, praising it when it does something good. In battle, when your partner asks you to switch or to use sword skill, try to offer your help. How do you do that? If you do so, your partner will execute a powerful joint attack. Alright, how do you do that? Survival skill. You might encounter deadly enemies in the future, so pay attention now if you want to survive. There are all kinds of enemies around us. Since this is a chaotic area, enemies of different power levels will all show up. It's best to know how powerful your enemy is. Face the enemy and press the triangle button to make the cursor fly towards the target. Okay. Press the triangle button? Face the enemy and press the triangle. Okay. Enemy's name and level will be shown on the top right of the screen. Enemies with a high level will be tougher to beat. You can roughly tell enemy power level by looking at the radar's light dot color. Be careful of the crimson light dot. So we want to be scared of the red dots. Move cursor over enemy and press triangle to throw dagger. Really? Pull and add. Move cursor over enemy and press the triangle to throw dagger. Throwing weapons do not cause much damage, but you can use this skill to lure enemies. It is called pulling. Ah, so if you like got like a mob of freaking creatures right next to each other, it's like, oh hell no, I can't fight all these guys. I can pull one of them at a time maybe. Ah, okay, I get it. If there's an enemy close by when you are in combat, that enemy will join the fight against you. This is called an add or a reinforcement. Kill stranded enemies instead of being surrounded by them in a much safer tactic. We advise you not to rush it. Damn it. Alright, let's go. What was your name again? I forgot. It's been 25 minutes since we last uh, saw the first episode. Ephelia. Doesn't even display which floor we're on. I should be voice acting. Come on, man. Go Bandai. Give me like... You ain't even gotta pay me a lot. Just pay me like a couple couple hundred thousand. No. <laughs> that's more, that's way more than voice actors get paid. The hollow area. Hollow area. <laughs> hollow area. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I know, I know, I know. I should be laughing. Hikari 
フィリオにはないんだろう。え。というか、ここでそんな文様があるプレイヤーなんて見たことない。え。ここにはフィリア以外にもプレイヤーがいるのか。え。でも少しおかしなところがあるというか。おかしなところ。説明が難しいの。Alright, cool, but let me take this picture really quick. Alright. Damn. Oh, I thought he was done talking. My bad. でも。あんたがいれば入れる気がする。その文様と同じものが描かれていたから。文様が浮かんできたのはスカルリーパーを倒したことがきっかけのようだけど。でも私には文様が出なかった。あんた。こんなことが起きるスキルなんて聞いた
<laughs> this is seriously, uh, if I want to say the way it's laid, the, the way the interface is, it feels like an MMO. And the only MMO I've ever played was Final Fantasy XIV. And honestly, just by looking at the interface and everything, it's just... And I can still move looking at this, which is ridiculous, but it's super choppy, the frame rate, with the menu open. It just looks very familiar to an MMO. <laughs> A single-player MMO, excuse me. It's the upgraded dot hack sign. That's exactly what this game is, but let's take a look at some of our skills. In Revolver, Slash Attack 2 hit, Low Chance Bind AoE. Countless... Spike. In Revolver. Is that my skill set? Oh, these are all my skills. I thought this was her skill set. Huh. I did not re... I did not... Okay, so this is what I initially thought. I thought... When you push R in the middle of combat, you bring up the skill palette or whatever, and then the directional pad was for your CPU ally skills, and then the uh, the direct not the directional but the the button inputs like the R triangle, R square. I thought those were my skills, but apparently all, each one of these skills are mine. So let's see, Locus Hegdra. Slash attack 7, 30% agility or strength, agility, grants paralysis, so that stuns the enemy I guess, so we want to do that to stun enemies, high chance AOE, area of attack, or area of effect, right, <clears throat> low chance blind AOE, <coughs> so with this he gets super armor, so when you activate that you can't, you can't get interrupted it looks like. But his other skills, like his battle skills, look like they are interruptible. Increases your... You and your party's members' defense. Only with shield. I don't have a shield, though. Shield defense. Parries attacks firmly and restores slight HP. Only with shield. Are you serious? Only with a shield? But I can activate the skill? Enemies' attack speed will become very slow for a while. I should probably start off battles by de like you know, debuffing the enemies first. Again, I apologize. I just had to uh, cough up a storm off camera, um, or off the mic, I should say. Barst consumes burst gauge to attack powerfully. High hit and combo bonus, huh? Consumes burst gauge to dodge with steps. Consumes SP when not fighting. I can tell you right now, this game is looking pretty fun once you get to understand the battle system and understand all the mechanics. Because it looks like there's a lot of skills for you to learn in this game. And I love, I love grinding. And and it's just, it's looking like I'm going to do have to do a lot of grinding to get a lot of these skills. Wait, I don't want to set this. I can't set that. Here we go. So what we want to do is back out of that menu, all right, and get to exploring. All right, Orc Crusher. All right, let's try to fight this Orc Crusher. Oh wait, it was for. Okay, the directional pad was for her. Alright, I just switched. Right now, I'm just trying stuff out. You know. What just happened? I don't know. But these orcs... Oh, this dude's dead. That dude was dead. <laughs> he was dead. How do I use the other skills? Huh. Oh, okay, okay, I get it. R brings up another set of skills, L brings up another set of skills. I didn't realize that. 
All right. Whooping ass. Right, let's stun him. All right, we got him stunned. Oh, Rod. All right, I'm getting used to it now. I'm discovering. Big press. Oh, I should have. I should have sidestepped that. Oh, he missed. I sidestepped it. Let's go. Okay, that's awesome. Okay, I'm getting used to it now. A little bit. Gotta take it slow, man. We can't rush it. Like the game said, we can't rush the combat. So L basically brings up the second skill palette, and R brings up the other skill palette. Nice. I didn't. I thought. I basically thought R brings up the same skill palettes, and then you use the directional pad with the R. But the di directional pad will always be for, <clears throat> for I guess you could say support, support and um, I guess strategy changes with the allies. Right now, what we want to do is just make our way through this area. We have yet to get a level up. All right, I think I'm getting the hang of this now. Wait, oh no! Dude, I don't know where I'm going anymore. I have a horrible... I say this in every playthrough I do. So if you are very new to any of the playthroughs that I do, I have a horrible sense of direction and I will get lost very easily if I don't constantly look at the map. I'm just saying that right now. Uh, you know what? Let's pull this guy. Let's hit him! Alright, I already got him. Oh, I did not stun him. <clears throat> Alright, now he's stunned. Now he's stunned. Alright, alright. Upper swing has been cancelled. Alright, you see what I just did there? I pulled this guy away. Come here, buddy. Come get your ass whooped for free. Damn it. I keep messing up. Wow, that dude got bodied. Oh, we got ores. Windy flower ore. Okay, sweet. I think we can fight the other dude by himself now. Alright, let's go. What the? Where'd he go? Let me fight you. <laughs> I thought he wouldn't let me fight him for a second. Oh yeah, he's dead. Nice. I keep spamming the same one because that move is so good. But I'm running out of SP. And it looks like we gain SP by just standing around. Can we get SP by moving? Yep, we can. Alright, so that's really smart. We can just stand still and recover our SP if we need to. Um, We should try to fight as many enemies along the way to try to level up, I guess. So let's attack this guy. Oh yeah. Yo, that is so... Level 1 sacred... What? What was that? Why we get so much experience for that? Alright, this that's all I'm gonna do. Like, that combo seems to net us more experience for some odd reason. Alright, so, it doesn't matter. Alright. I didn't realize it, but apparently some skills don't even waste burst. It just waste, it just waste uh, SP. Some skills waste just burst. Some skills just waste SP. Alright, like I said, we're just learning a lot. Oh, it looks like we got a chest. It was sealed by an unimaginable force. Come on! I've, 
What? I can't open a chest? What is this madness? Wait, is that the guy we gotta fight? Uh, that's not the guy. Nope. Punish Wrath Bull. No, we ain't ready for that. We ain't about that life right now. <laughs> we ain't about that life. But we will cast this dude away. Alright, let's try to do that combo again. Here we go. Oh yeah, you did. <laughs> Yo, that is so smooth. I like the way it feels. Combat is not as bad as I thought. I thought it was going to be like auto combat where you like literally stand there, stand there. Oh, let me just hit one of my shortcuts and do something else and just stand there, stand there. But you actually got to push buttons. I like it. Fresh buttons. I guess you got to mash buttons. Maybe I like mashing buttons. Did we get health back too? Can I cast... Can I cast magic while being away from an enemy? Yeah, it looks like you actually get health back, but can I also cast magic? Yes, you can. It wastes it waste SP, but you know what? SP gets recovered over time. Alright, cool. Get stuck. Wrecking these enemies left and right now. Let's try to take two on at a time. Oh wait, I'm not supposed to do that. All right, burst finish. Okay. All right, sweet. Burst finish, we couldn't do it. So, can you parry? Speedmaster. So, we're, I just activated Speedmaster, so I guess we get to attack faster? Or, excuse me, I guess we recover burst faster or SP? What does Speedmaster do? Risk breakdown, huh? And 150. There's so much stuff I still need to learn. Did we just loop around? No, we couldn't have just looped around. This area is huge. Whoa. I'm pretty sure we ain't got to fight. Oh, hell no, homie. Uh, nah, no thanks. <laughs> no thanks. We have yet to get a damn level up. Can we open this one? You know what? We probably, you know what we got to do to open those chests? We probably have to defeat those huge type enemies right there. Those higher level enemies. But we ain't about that life right now. We're just gonna run away with our tails between our legs because we know we ain't about that life right now. We are not strong enough. We are not experienced enough to face enemies of such unimaginable force. <laughs> so what we wanna do is find this damn muscle bullhorn. Oh my goodness, where is this guy? No, you know what, he's, he's probably this way. Cause it looks like we're not getting a lot of experience. How far is it into our next level up, by the way? <clears throat> Does it even give us? Dude, <laughs> we're nowhere close to getting an another level up. <laughs> we're, <laughs> we're about like 60 fights away, homie. Alright. Damn it. I guess what we need to do is actually go north and make a left. Damn. All this exploration though. For real? <coughs> I'm guessing this is exactly where we go next. Oh, uh, you know what? I almost forgot about something. 
I just realized my beauty was about to die. Give me a second. <laughs>